the halting problem in order to further illustrate the difficulties of properly defining an algorithm, consider the following. Let us uh, assume that we formally defined what an algorithm is. Then if uh, somebody gives us a text, uh, capital T, we can surely decide whether capital T is an algorithm or not, can we not? Even more strongly, we can surely find a generic way that is an algorithm that decides whether T is an algorithm or not, can we not? In particular, we can surely decide that if we give a specific point little t to capital T, then capital T will eventually halt or go into an infinite loop, can we not? It turns out that no, we cannot. Let us assume that we can, that is, that there exists an algorithm hot of t, t, capital T text, with little t, t input, so that hot of t, t is equal to yes, if t hot, when given t as input, uh, is equal to no, if t goes into an infinite loop, when given t as input. What we do next will sound familiar to readers who took a course on set theory. We will present a proof by the so-called diagonalization method. Write the program diagonal so that the diagonal of S is equal to return yes if and the hot if hot of SS is no and the diagonal S is equal to goes into an infinite loop if hot of SS is yes. Now we are making one more step of uh, this strange self-referring kind. We feed the diagonal to itself as input. We are diagonal of diagonal stop or not. Let us uh, consider both possible answers. One, let us assume that first diagonal of diagonal hots. By the definition of diagonal, that means that hot of diagonal diagonal is no. However, by the definition of hot, that means the diagonal does not halt on itself. This is a contradiction. Two, let us now assume that diagonal of diagonal goes into an infinite loop. By the division of diagonal, that means that hot of diagonal diagonal is yes. However, by the definition of hot, that means that diagonal does halt on itself. This again is a contradiction. So our original assumption that hot exists led to a contradiction. Therefore, hot does not exist. It is important to point out that all we proved is that there is no algorithm that would decide whether any given text t is an algorithm. That is, whether t will hot on an arbitrary input t. For a specific text t, we can very often decide whether t hots on t or not.